And you know, hello. Um, I have a few comments. Go ahead. Okay. Um, I saw you used um, one of the websites called uh, Ahl Quran. Hmm. I I checked it and then I found it is um, made by uh, the Quranists. You know the Quranists who reject the Hadith. Yeah, so but obviously they are... we Muslims. Uh, yeah, they're, they're not Muslims. Oh, they are so, Muslims. Uh, okay. Hmm. Yeah. So so the 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 tafsir that you used, uh, we cannot accept that from that website. Hmm. So so but... do you think regarding the the baby, the babies who are killed, and it does not really refer to babies. Do you think uh, there is a uh, authentic source? I mean, from the the the, the tafsir that we accept. You, in, you see, you see, my friend, the Muslims. I, I will show you something. When the Muslim they say to you, Muhammad do not know how to write, how to read. Do you agree with that? Can we talk uh, about the thing? Yeah, you will talk about that. We are talking about that. Don't worry, we are not changing. But just to show you that Muslims are disconnected with their religion. Do you agree that Muhammad do not know how to write, how to read? Yes. Okay. Where do you get this from? From Tafsir, right? From um, the, the Quran. Nowhere in the Quran it says Muhammad cannot know how to read, how to write. Yes, uh, it says that. No. Let me show you, my friend. Chapter 2, verse number 78. Give us definition. What is the word ummi mean? You know what ummi, right? Mm -hmm. What ummi mean? Read with me carefully. Ummi so who is the ummiyun? Is the, the one? People. No, the one who do not know the book. Do you see it? La yalamun al kitaba illa amani. So. The Quran, this is a book of religion. This is not a book of education about writing or reading. And this does, does not no, disqualify you, does not disqualify you because you know how to write, how to read. Is it true that the Quran call all the Christians and the Jews people of the book? The Jews and the Christians people mm -hmm. of the book? Yeah, people yes, of the book, okay. Right. Why we are called people of the book? Is that because we know how to write, how to read, all of us? Or because we yeah, have a book? Yeah, because you have a book. Okay, so now why he is calling those who they don't have a book? All of them they call them ummiyin because they don't have a book. Do you agree? Um, I I do not agree that. Um, why the verse in the front you, you of can, you? Well, I, I don't think that you can um, use the verse that is used here and say it my friend, the same thing. My friend, no, because this is what the Quran is speaking about. This is about. God, He defined you as illiterate or knowledgeable by what? By knowing God, not by writing or reading. If we go in the hadith, you will find that Muhammad, he said, you are a person who said that the one who reject the hadith is not a Muslim for you, correct? Yes, that's right. Okay. Look what Muhammad, he said. Uh, read with me. Are you going to, read with me. I'm, I'm going to show you that Muslims are the Muslims are disconnected with their, with their cult. This is Sahih al Bukhari. This is a Sahih Hadith. When Muhammad was in the element of his death, look what Muhammad he said. When Allah Messenger was in his death deathbed, and there why there were some men in the house, he said, "Come near. I will write for you something after which you will not go astray." Some of them i.e. the companion said Allah messenger is seriously ill they accuse him to be sick and you have we have the Holy Quran Allah book is sufficient for us so the people of the house differed and started disputing some of them said give him writing material so he might write for you something Christian Benz, what point are you going to? My friend, what point are you here we to? go. The Muslims, they say to you, Muhammad, do not know how to write, how to read. Okay, and this is Sahih right. al-Bukhari saying that he knows how to write, how to read. How they say to him, give him material to write. 
this is a very well known uh, Christian prince that uh, Muhammad can No, not know. very well known. This is not a, the, the, no, this is not true. This is not true. This is a fa there's no. no proof of it. There's no proof of it, my friend. There's no okay. Give me a single proof where it says that Muhammad do not know how to write, how to read. I'm listening. Go ahead. Look, regarding the, the, the word uh, Al Ummi, mm. Ibn, Ab Ibn, Ab Ibn Abbas mm. uh, um, interprets this word to mean that. He cannot read all right there's also another verse in the quran mm. which says um thank you very and much you did not and thank you, you not, yeah so uh, yes recite yeah, but because he was not a believer because he is not a believer he he, he never read a, a, a book which which book he never received a book he's a kafir isn't it the Quran says iman? You never know what is faith and what is belief. Look, also, also, Tafsir Qutubi says Al Umiyun. I, 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 I know, I know. You see, you are go, you are going by the Tafsir, but the Tafsir is fooling you. Read with me carefully. This is the Quran. وكذلك أوحينا. Listen, my friend. Listen. وكذلك أوحينا إلي إليك روح من أمرنا وما كنت تدري ما الكتاب ولا الإيمان. You know not what is book and what is faith. So what was the faith so, of your prophet before? So now you want me to reject the tafsir, is that correct? My friend, it, it, is that, is do you accept the Quran or do you accept the Quran or you accept the tafsir over the Quran? The Quran says Muhammad, he have never have faith and never have belief and never have book. This is what make him illiterate. No, no there is there, there is a tafsir that we accept. Obviously, sometimes there's a difference of opinion. No, 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 no. There is many, there is many Muslims don't agree with those tafsir. You can go right now, search on Google, my friend. Trust I, I me. Know, I know, okay. I know. Okay. So, know. Is, is it true? Is it true that there's Muslims believe? Well, hold on. Is it true that there is many Muslims? A lot of them believe that Muhammad knows how to write, how to read. Yes or no? Yes. Uh, okay. So why, why you are picking up a, 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 a thing which is goes against the Quran? The Quran says what it's meant by being illiterate, because. If, if I if I go right now and search in the Quran about the word Ummi, we will find that there is tons of uh, 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 phrases in the Quran speaking about who is who is the Ummi, what Ummi mean. All of it confirm that Ummi mean one thing: that the one who have no book. If we go right now, I advise you right now to Christian go. Prince, Christian Prince, hmm. Christian Prince, I have no problem to say that there might be a difference of opinion. I understand that there right. are things that there's a difference of opinion. I'm yeah. not saying this is. Exactly, because I think that uh, the, the stronger opinion is that he mm. can neither read or write, mm. because there are many, many evidences for that. Mm. Um, but anyway, why do you use a website? Okay, did, did, would you say that you didn't know it was made by Qurans? I told you, I show, actually, actually, I, 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 actually, I showed in the screen that this is Ahlul Quran, which means the Quranic, yeah. correct? Did I, did I lie? No, I showed you. This is made by Ahlul Quran. Okay. Okay. Well, the Quran is called themselves the followers of the Quran. Okay. Uh, so. Still, okay. You know, okay. Let me so, let me ask you. Uh, let me let me ask you. Know. Did Muhammad order you to follow only the Quran, or to follow the Hadith? Allah ordered us to follow the Quran, and Muhammad as well. Okay, guys, the screen. You don't see the screen. Hold on. I'm oh, sorry for that. Uh, people don't see the screen. Give me a second. The, the 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 Quran order you to follow, uh, to follow the the Hadith and the Quran. The Quran and the Hadith. Okay, where where which verse is saying you have to follow the Quran and the Hadith? Do you know? Uh, have you ever heard of it? Yes. Hmm. Yes, obey Allah and obey the Messenger. Okay, thank you very much. Obey Allah and obey the Messenger. Mm -hmm. But your Prophet, yes. he said, never, never write my Hadith. Uh, um, how you can follow how you can follow how you can follow the hadith if Muhammad he order you not to write his hadith well when he said that do not write the hadith it was it was about do not write it at his time it was not about not following uh -huh. his, uh, okay his Hold, okay it was about so isn't it better to write it in his time what, 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 okay my friend what, I, where it says let, let me just let me just say that because uh, at that time um, he did not want people to get confused between the Quran and the Hadith. That's why he said. What do you okay, Where do you get the tafsir from? Is that uh, from, from your own or? No, that's what. Uh, hmm. they, but that's does it say here? Does it say here? Does it say here? Don't write it now. Write it later. Does it say that? 
No, this is generally what we well, understand. People, they want to explain that. why we wrote it for you. So they say, okay, he, he meant at that time. But as you see, this is that this is the hate in front of us. It doesn't say anywhere course, that this is not about certain time. This is about all the time. Same time. Course, same time. Course, hold on, hold on, hold on. If we go to the verse, the one we are talking about, the one about al Yeah. The, the 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 people of the Quran they gave you a very powerful answers for that. Why? Because they showed you verses from the Quran where the Quran says that I will I will, I will, I will not take um, a website made by the Quran. It's unbelievable. Well, this is this is your choice. If you don't want this is this is uh, this is your uh, this is your issue. But but you see, okay. you have to refute okay. them. You have to refute them in what they said. You cannot, yeah. I, and I, I cannot take what they say because they are Muslims and they believe in the Quran and they prove to you from the Quran that this is what it's mean. Well, if they have, um, if they have a wrong understanding, and then how you, how you know it's wrong understanding? Where, 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 okay, we where, we where, can, okay, where your prophet? Hold on, let us do this. Where, I don't think, that. my friend, where your prophet said that this is about killing babies? Did your prophet say that? I. Uh, Obviously, I believe that it means that because this is what we all Muslims believe. No problem. That's my, no, not my all, not all Muslims. Muslims. As you my, see, my, as you see, as you see, this is not all Muslims. This is not all Muslims. If well, somebody, why, why why not all Muslims? Yeah, that, that's why I'm asking. Is there a tafsir by Tabari by Ibn Kathir by any Muslim scholar that we that we trust that says otherwise? So okay, okay. Let let, let, let me ask Islam. you. The, uh, uh, so you are taking the tafsir of Ibn Kathir, let us say Ibn Kathir. If I show you something from Ibn Kathir and that is disgusting, do you accept Ibn Kathir or you will say I don't accept Ibn Kathir? When I say Ibn Kathir, the Tabari and all these things, I mean, what generally Muslim scholars... Uh, I know, I know, I know, my friend, my friend, hold on, Look, hold on. Hold I, on. Do not, I do not accept one scholar for everything he says. Hmm. Not because I, I do not like it, Okay. But because uh, sometimes uh, scholars make mistakes, hmm. as we follow them and then. Okay, my friend, my friend, let us do this. Let us do this. Doesn't the Quran what? says anything about the word there that this is a girl? What? Does the Quran? Does the Quran? You, the, you, you, the Muslim they say that the Quran is the most clear Arabic language. Is that correct? Yes. Okay. Uh, where uh, there, where it says that this is a girl, which is the one is buried. Mean? Where it says that? That's correct. What's correct? Because simply this is an infant girl, female is the one who's buried. This is the interpretation saying, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, what is the word infant and what is the word girl in the verse? Can't Allah put the word girl there? I mean, is Allah is, is short in, in, in saying words? Can't he add a word? Can't he say this is a girl? Where is the word girl? There's a question always you need to ask yourself. If this is a if this is a verse, if this is a verse speaking about a girl, then the girl should be mentioned there, but there is no girl. And here they are they are, they are giving you they are giving you a very clear uh, uh, explanation, saying that this is against even the Quran, because the Quran the Quran it, it confirmed that so, uh, a, an infant child he is unaware of anything. This is what the Quran says. So, Christian Prince, do you admit that the reliable sources of Islam do not say anything that go against my friend? What we believe? There is a only, there is a debate. Hold on. You have is the, the Quran. Okay, okay. There's a debate happening between me and Doctor uh, Rohi. Have you, have you ever heard of him from Al Azhar University? Go watch um, it. He said uh, he said that Tafsir. I asked him about Tafsir. He said Tafsir is a created to solve a problem. What is the problem to defend Islam? Tafsir never explained the Quran. If I show you right now, Ibn Kathir, Ibn Abbas, etc., and you are the one who said to me, I will pick up my, my cherries, I will choose what I like. And that means that no, they're in, they're in no, yeah, yeah, yes, because okay, I showed you if I show you something stupid, uh, okay. It's okay, let, let, listen, me. listen, okay. If all uh, I will go with your logic. If all the scholars agree upon upon one thing, does that mean they are right? Yes. Okay. If I show you right now how Allah He created the baby, and all the Muslim scholars agree that babies are happening because women have a sperm coming from their ribs and men they have a sperm coming from their backbone and this is by the agreement of Ibn Kathir and Al-Tabari and Al-Qurtubi and Al-Jalalain and Ibn Abbas do you agree with that? By the ribs? I, I don't think they say that Sorry? I don't think they say that Okay, here we go, let us go 
in front of you just to show you that if the Muslims agree upon something it, it, it uh, you uh, uh, you yourself you will deny it in a second here we go this is a chapter 86 no I will not deny anything but no. I will say that uh, I will look into it no okay my, my problem but you said you don't you just said you don't think they will do that right you, you don't um, think it says that you, you don't think it says I, that right I will question the the consensus okay but all yeah, of them I'll, agree I'll, 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 but all of them agree I mean how you explain to me such such a madness you, your point, your your logic is, if all the scholars who do interpretation, they agree upon something, must be true. It's, it's not my logic. It, this is what Islam says. Okay, no problem. But so, so obviously, I'm proving the logic of Islam to be wrong. Here we go. All the scholars agree that women, they have a sperm coming from their ribs, and men, they have a sperm coming from the backbone. Name for me one scholar you like, and I will show you in the screen. Go ahead. We can switch to Arabic. Hmm, here we go. This is the Arabic page. <coughs> Which scholar you want? Let me show you how many scholars here in this list. Everything you wish, whatever you want. Which one you want? Look, look, look how long the list. All of them, they agree with the same. So what we will do now? All of them, they say the Quran saying that women have a sperm coming from the ribs, the location of the necklace, and the man have a sperm coming from the backbone. So here we go. The Muslim scholars agree uh, in something very stupid. What we will do? I, I, I do not agree with you there. So uh, all the scholars now, okay. You see now, look what you are doing. No. Okay, well, look, 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 look. A second no, ago, no. okay, a second ago, you said you don't agree with Ahl Quran because they don't bring you something coming from I, the tafsir. I, I, I do not, I do not agree with your method. No, this is your you method. Think... This is your method now. It's not mine because you are I, the one who said. You are the I, one who I said. I, I think you're misunderstanding the tafsir. Because Which tafsir? That... Okay, how am I saying that? You explain it to me. You explain it to me. I'm not going. to Choose one, and I will read for you. Choose one. You, you just. You, you just said that the, the sperm comes from uh, the backbone and this and that. I did not say that. No. It's the Quran saying that, the Quran verse by verse. Yes, yes. I'm saying this is uh, your misunderstanding, I think. Okay. So this is why I'm not okay. My friend, okay, how it is my misunderstanding, how it is my misunderstanding, if all your scholars, the one you are saying to me, why you, did, you, you bring me the, the explanation from Ahl quran the Quran only, but you don't bring me from the scholars. If all the scholars get that understanding, so you are saying to me that all the scholars they have wrong understanding. No, I, I didn't say that. I okay, so name for me one scholar he don't have that wrong understanding. Of what? Of the verse about the the, the sperm no, coming from the backbone uh, and the sperm coming I mean, from the ribs. Obviously, uh, I uh, I've not come prepared to. To answer this one, uh, my, my friend, see, I'm, I'm speaking I, with the logic you are you are giving to me. If the scholars mm -hmm. is your is your you, reference, you're me to bring it my friend, my friend, here. my and friend, obviously, I don't have with me now. No I problem. Looked into it. Okay. If 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 your logic is, if we need to understand the verse, we have to go only by the tafsir, and go against the logic. Then here we go. You what, yourself, you just rejected what, the logic. What logic? The logic of what it's meant. The logic of make makes sense. The logic of what it says. So the Quran never say the word girl. The Quran never mm -hmm. say the word infant. So where they come this with this from? You need to ask ourselves if the Quran. Wait, tafsir. Thank you very I, much. I, tafsir I, says I, that. I, I am sure. Okay. Now we have Quran. We have Quran. Say that the the, the 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 word of the Quran itself saying that clearly that women have a sperm coming from their bone backbone. So from their rib. Sorry, and oh, the man have a sperm wait, coming backbone. What? Why do you want to go to the other point? Because this is the same so thing. Go, the same thing. Either you accept the tafsir, either you accept the tafsir as the, as as a as a ref, as a reference for you to prove a point, or you don't accept it. So here we go. All the tafsir, all the tafsir. Okay. So Christian what we are doing here? We have two apples. We have two apples. Christian Prince. Christian Prince. Yeah. My point was that in the beginning, you are using a a tafsir that we do not trust. Okay, against us. And okay. Do you I trust? Think, okay. Which one you trust? Wait. Which one wait, you trust? Wait, wait, wait. The, the, the ones. But, but you said you, you don't trust anyone because you said to me you don't agree with them in everything. That's mean you don't trust what they say. But I see that your point now is that you, you want to say that they are that they are wrong and they cannot be trusted. Anymore. I don't hear you. Your voice has gone away. Uh, I, I'm saying that um, you are trying to make the point that we should not trust the tef the, 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 the tafsir, and I th and I'm saying uh, this is not the point. Why do you want to argue that the, the tafsir that we trust are incorrect? Because because here we go. All of them they agree. Just, just to, either just, the Quran, just to, 
wait, just to defend your the, the idea that you it's, can it's use. not my idea. It's not my idea. The, the, it's not my the, idea. The, the I just shared with you. Honest. No, no, no. I just shared with you what a huge part of Muslims they believe, and I they gave you the reference of what they say. They did not just make a plain accusation saying, Oh, those who say that they are wrong. They give you reference. The Quran says the following, and they give you verses one after one. So you are going by some group going against other group, and you just say that the one who don't accept the hadith is not a Muslim. Where in the Quran it says that? Where in the Quran it says if you explain the Quran, not using because because simply when you say to me you don't accept hadith, right? If there is a hadith says that this is about your prophet, he said that this is about women or child who they are buried. Did your prophet say that? In, in the hadith, yeah. I, I, I do not know personally. Okay, so this is me. This is me. They, they have they have to come with the conclusion as an example. When in chapter 18, Alexander the Great he found the sun set in a murky water. If Muhammad he explained that in the hadith, if Muhammad explained that in the hadith and he says the sun set in murky water, then it must be this is what it's meant, correct? I, I'm not following you. Wait, wait. Let okay, me let, let me make it simple for you. If Muhammad explained that verse, that this is about infant baby who is buried, then I have to agree that this is what it is because obviously Muhammad he know better what it's meant. Correct? Yes. Okay. Can you show me a hadith saying that? Christian Prince, let, let me make my point to that that mm -hmm. I wanted to say. I am saying to you, do not use a website that Muslims do not consider to be non-Muslims. Your point was that I, I should also not, not trust any tafsir, and, I, and I'm saying this is a separate point. If you wanna, if you wanna say the uh, the, the Muslim scholars are stupid, I'm saying okay, that, that that's fine. That it's a it's a separate point. But we Muslims only trust Muslim scholars, and you are using sources that we do not trust, and I think you are wrong on that. Okay, let, let, let me let me answer about this. No problem. That's I like, got yeah. I got your point. No problem. Listen. Yeah. When you say to me that we Muslim we trust Muslim scholars, that is not a true because Muslim don't trust for this for, for any Muslim. I call him. You call me right now. If I ask him which scholar you agree to explain to me that verse, if he explained that verse and you say to me only that verse he was right, it means he is no scholar. If you no. say to me that from the whole book, this guy is is I, I agree with him about this verse, that means you are making him a scholar only about that verse. No, 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 no. We, 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 we respect scholars. What All scholar? Okay, here we go. Here, the scholar they say that women they have a sperm coming from their ribs. What we will do now? Uh, <laughs> All the scholars, your name. Na name anyone for me. Which one? Uh, I, I think this is your this is your understanding, and I disagree. No, no, it's not understanding. Here we go. You, you know, you, you, you know, my friend, my friend. You know Arabic. You know agree. Arabic. You know Arabic. I know Arabic. So. Tell me where this is my understanding. We can go to the English. Where is my understanding? I'm not the one saying that. It's not true. It is their understanding. I'm just reading for you. I share with people in the screen what Muslims they say, not what I say. So if this is their understanding, then okay, let us see if it is. If it's not, it's my understanding. Prove me wrong. Here we go. This is Tafsir Jalalain, issuing from between the loins of the man and the breast bones of the women. You want me to go Arabic? I will go to Arabic. Choose any scholar you want. Ibn Abbas, the other one who mentioned Ibn Abbas. Ibn Abbas is the cousin of Muhammad. Issued from between the loins of the man, which is the backbone, and the ribs of the women. Which one you want? This is not my yeah. understanding. So now this is funny. Yeah. This is this is stupid. This is can't be from God. So what we will do now? We take the scholars, or we don't take the scholars. Okay, but the scholars they say that women they have a sperm coming from their ribs, all of them. Ibn Abbas, Ibn Kathir, Al Tabari, Al Qurtubi, Al Jalalain. Where does it say? Where does it say sperm? Huh? Where does it say sperm? The verse number six it says gushing fluid. The man is created from gushing fluid, which is coming from yeah. where? Coming from between the backbone of the man and the ribs of the women. Okay, uh, th that might uh, require me to go and look into it a bit more. Okay, uh, but okay. anyway, anyway, my friend, my, my friend, yeah, if, if this verse in the Quran is wrong, if this verse is in the Quran, proving to us that God cannot be God, because there is no way God will say such a thing, that a sperm coming from the backbone and the sperm coming from the ribs of the women. Christian Prince, hmm. 
do you agree with me that you should not use websites made by non-Muslims? Those, those are Muslims, my that, friend. That, 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 you, for you, you no, are not Muslims. No, no, no. You I'm, see, I'm talking, for you, that, no, 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 no. But for me, they are Muslims. They follow Quran only. You know, for all Quran only. So that will not make them not Muslims because it's not you who define who is a Muslim or not. Do you think? Yeah, do you think it's appropriate for me to use Jehovah's Witness to argue a case? Jehovah's Witnesses, Muslim? they have Jehovah's Witnesses. They have different book. They don't have the same book. Do, do you think I should use their book? They don't have the same Bible. They don't. Might, no, no, you cannot because you don't have the same Bible. The Jehovah's Witnesses the translation is is, is 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 fake. So you, you see the Quran well, people. Well, well, listen, well, the well, the Quran only. They use the same Quran you use. Do you agree? Yeah, but okay. they Jehovah, no, okay. Jehovah's Witnesses, they don't use the same Bible we use. They have different Bible. But but do they make the claim that uh, it comes from uh, the time of Jesus? Or Doesn't matter. They, this is different Bible. That's well, the, the Bible well, says yeah. anyone who comes with other true. scriptures than this, he is a, he's, he's, he's not he, he's, he's not a believer. So those people, they have fake translation, they added words, they change everything. But the people of the Quran, they change nothing of your Quran. They have a book as it is. And they are refuting you from their book, not from their from a book of Jehovah's Witnesses. So we cannot compare between them and say, "Oh, Jehovah's Witnesses, they did the same." No, my friend, they did not. Those are people who they have the Quran, the same as you have between your hand, and they are refuting you from the Quran you have, not from a new Quran which they fabricated, and that make a huge difference. If uh, and I do not know about this, but I'm just using it as, a, as an example. If the Jehovah's Witnesses. Do make the claim that uh, their Bible comes from the time of Jesus. Okay, you might disagree with that, but I can say to you, well, their Bible might be also correct. Uh, no so problem, of my friends. But this is not this is not the topic because what you think. because their book is yeah. not the same as our book, so we cannot even use the same book for the same argument because here they are using the same book you have. This is not a different book. This is not different. They are not using translation. They are using the same exact Arabic. And here they yeah, are giving yeah. you a very very good refutation. Actually, if you read with me. It says, uh, 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 if you see the screen with me, you see the screen. Okay, that's that's fine. Let's, let's, okay. let's, let's move to another point. The 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 next point you said about um, the prophet flirting with his uh, son's wife, hmm. and I am sure you have heard many Muslims, many Muslim scholars have said that this narration is not based on a on authentic hadith. Okay. It's not based uh, on authentic it's hadith. Not, it's not based on authentic hadith. So mm. Muslim scholars have always been saying this is false. That we do not trust it. We do not trust it. And you okay. have been recycling this over and over again. Let us and go. Last, let us go by what you said. Let us go. Let us go by what you said. The last time, the last time was Shamsi. At the end of his video, mm. in response to you, he said to you, "This uh, narration is weak. We do not take it." So who who, who is Shamsi? Is that she, is that a scholar? No, he's not a scholar, but he's okay. Own, um, okay. His, uh, knowledge. My friend, okay, my friend. If this is, if this is, if this is, if this is not accepted, why it is in the book of Al Qurtubi and why Al Qurtubi, who is a scholar, did not say this is garbage? We will not even put it here. Do, do, do you know that? Well, uh, the tafsir, they, they, they do not say everything we talk, we, we, we bring is. Who is the one then he says? If, if it is not right, why you put it in the tafsir to explain something? For if you want to example, explain something, no, hold on. If you want to explain something to me, are you going to bring a lie to explain it? No, 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 uh, no, no. Hmm. Uh, Shem Shemsi said that. Uh, Shemsi said, "Who is Shemsi?" I mean, you all keep saying to me, "Shemsi said." Where is the reference of Shemsi? Yeah. Can you show me? Well, let, let me, let me, let me uh, respond to you. Um, I know that uh, that the seal of Hawaii, he said in his um, in his. In his writing, that's not everything that he, he uh, that he mentions in his tafsir is is uh, is authentic. Hmm. But he uses what, whatever he hears hmm. in order to uh, to explain. But I did not mention a tabari for you. I'm not showing a tabari anyway. I, I'm, I'm I'm saying to you just to explain that not hmm. everything in the in the tafsir is, is is based on authentic narrations. So we 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 might uh, so we use the, the tafsir to understand verses and stuff like that. But not, not every narration they bring is based on authentic uh, hadiths. Okay. So, so when you say that, why do they put it in their in their books? It, it, it's irrelevant. It, it's just that uh, not everything is accepted by them. All right. But you have been told over and over again, this narration we don't accept it. Most Muslims, most Muslims do not accept it. Why do you still recycle it? 
All right. Let's go then to something you like. This is the, the hold on, hold on, hold on. You see, I'm going with your logic. I'm going step by step. This is Sahir Bukhari. This is Sahir Bukhari. Hold on. Let us see your Shamsi how he can help. Your, your Shamsi, he said to you that if it is not coming from the Sahih Hadith, we don't take it, correct? Hadith? Yeah. If it is Sahih, we accept it. Oh, thank you. Okay, this is this is Sahih Bukhari. This is Sahih Bukhari. Khawla bintu Hakim was one of those ladies who presented herself to the Prophet to give herself, not to marriage, to have sex with her. Aisha said, doesn't a lady feel ashamed of presenting herself to a man? And then this verse came. So now, do we agree with this or this is a fake hadith? Is it, is it safe? Uh, does it say Sahih? This is Sahih Bukhari. I mean, it's it, the name of the book is Sahih Bukhari, but it's weak hadith. No, okay. So, okay. So now we have women who they are coming to the Prophet, and one of them is Khawla bin to Hakim, and she is offering herself to the Prophet to sleep with him. Did Khawla bin to Hakim became or consider as a wife for Muhammad? You can go right now, search in Google. You will find that none of them is Khawla bin Hakim. Make your point. I, okay. I then I this is about sex. This is about just a pure sex. That's mean that Muhammad he take women just for his pleasure. I want you to respond to why you still recycle that narration when you've been told over and over again that Muslims don't accept that narration. Why do you my friend? Who is the Muslim who say don't accept that narration? Show me who are the those Muslims. Every scholar, if you, if you show me, show me the scholar. Too. You did not show me one. Did you show me one? <laughs> okay, uh, I'm talking about uh, contemporary scholars. It doesn't matter. So, you need to show me the scholar who don't accept that. What scholar? You know, if and at the same time, if a scholar don't accept that, and other scholar he accept that. So what we will do now? Which one we will kill? Do, do, do you have any scholar today who will accept that narration? You see, you are saying any scholar today. So are you saying yes, to me that the scholars before they accepted scholar today don't accept it because they are ashamed of it trying to get away with the shame of Muhammad do the scholars today no. accept that Khawla to Hakim she offered herself to the prophet and she is not his wife do they accept that or no look my, my point uh, Christian, my point my friend my point my point is very clear do the scholars today accept that Khawla to Hakim she offered herself to sleep with Muhammad yes or no if she offer herself to sleep I, with him, why I, she she why she is not considered as a wife unless this is a pure adultery, one night stand or few night stands. Do the scholars today accept that your prophet he said any Muslim women and Muslim men they can have sex together for three days, three night? Do they accept that? Today? No. Why? Why did they accept it today? But they accepted before. Which one are you talking about? Mm -hmm. What are you talking about? Here we go. This is Sahih Bukhari. You're a prophet, he said. Any Muslim man and any Muslim woman, they like to share the bed together. And the Muslim, they between two and two brackets, temporarily marriage, which is funny because this is not marriage. For three nights, if they like to continue, they can do so. If they like, they can separate. Do the Muslim today, they accept that or they don't? It's It's forbidden. What do you mean forbidden? But but isn't it your prophet? He practiced that. He uh, it was uh, made lawful and then it was forbidden. My so friend, my friend. But it, but isn't it? This is a clear proof that Muhammad have no dignity. How a man he allow a man and a woman to share bed together for three days, three nights? What is the logic talking, of that? I I can't talk to you about specific points. No, no, I'm not talking I about specific point. You see, I'm not going. I, I, no, 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 no. You I, see. I'm, I'm showing you I'm showing you how the scholars today they that the scholars today no, 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 they no, are no, game no, they are no, gamers no. they are gamers here we go no, this is what no, is accepted by Islam for no, centuries and the Muslim they accept the that okay the, hold on hold on hold on when when the Prophet he said when the Prophet he said anyone he is a proud about his father tell him to go and bite the penis of your father do the scholars today feel ashamed of that or they accept it Christian Prince let me uh, Again, say uh, something. It's irrelevant whether what whatever you talk about is 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 authentic or not. Or, or, or we should trust this color. My friend, not. my friend, but you did but not one, show me. You did not show me that At-Tabari he said that this hadith is not accepted by him. 
Did he say that? You say uh, that at Tabari like, said, at Tabari said, there's some hadith in the, in the explanation is not authentic, correct? Okay. Did he say that this hadith is not authentic? Which one? About Muhammad flirting with the wife of his son. My, my point is Muslims do not agree with the narration. That, that's my whole point. My friend, who is the Muslim don't agree? And who, how they cannot agree? I mean, it's in the front of you. Where the, the narration of the scholar I, himself? Did the scholar I, I, himself? I, I, he said. Did the scholar himself? He said. The one who presented to you the narration. Did he say that this is a false narration? Uh, I'm sure there is, but uh, no, no. The guy uh, who came I, with I, this. The guy who came with this. As an example, Al, -Qur -Al, -Al Qurtubi. Did he say? The, did he say? Did he say that this is this is not a true story? Um, the the the, the, the tafsir may say things like, "Okay, th this is what we have heard," but they do not say. Why? Why Al Qurtubi? Why Al Qurtubi is hiding the truth from us? Because based on what you are saying, Al Qurtubi is not being truthful, and he is. No, no. So why? So why he is hiding that from us? Why he is hiding? Why he is hiding that from us? What is the purpose of this lie? Why Al Qurtubi? Okay, you, you have, you have, my friend. Let, let, let me bring you the example of uh, Tabari. Hmm. He says that I have, I have mentioned in my book. Forget about the Tabari. Forget about the Tabari. Uh, uh, tabari, because you could you, not show you, me. You're, did did Tabari say? Is my friend? You are you're repeating you're yourself. Did Tabari say that this hadith, this hadith is false? A Tabari in his book, when the hadith is false, he say that this is not accurate for me. This is what the scholars do. He say this is a story reported, but we reject it. Let me just finish my statement, and mm. you will understand my point. Mm. So, Tabari said in his in his book that I have uh, mentioned in my books things that may be not correct. So, mm. whoever comes later, scholars who come after me, it's up to you to to take it or reject it. Mm. So, this means there are things that we may not be sure about, and he does he does not have to specifically mention one narration that says this one. Uh, be careful. I mentioned it, but it's not it's not uh, it's not authentic. So, do not say. Mm. Mm -hmm. uh, so he, he doesn't have to say that he don't have to so say he, that so who is the one he, have he, to he, say he, that who is the one who have to say that now if the scholar he, himself who is reporting the story for you and the one you are saying that we follow the interpretation he do not have to say that who is the one he have to say that the scholars after him the scholars after him who, scholars who after him they knew better than the scholars before him no so how they knew how they knew that this is not authentic the scars who came after him but he himself he did not notice that because the the, the, the scholars who come after him they may see the the, the chain of narration if it's good if okay it chain can of you show me the chain of narration can you show me the chain of narration my point Kirsten Prince my point I got you, your point my friend I got your point you know you you, 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 you see is, I, is I, I, I I I got your is point I got your point but you see you are not giving me you are not giving me you are not giving me a clear is it answer. A is clear it, answer. Is it, is it appropriate to you to use an argument that we generally don't accept? Who is the way we discuss that? Accept that? Who, who is we? When no, you say to me, no. we show me. Okay, well, you see, you keep no, saying no, to me, we. we, we you keep you keep saying to me, we, we, we. Muslims, Muslims, who is we? Where? No, show me. Show no, me where. Where? Show no, me where. Where it says that. No, no Muslim today accepts that. No, my friend. My no, friend. Who is the Muslim who don't accept? Show me. <laughs> Are you being serious? You are saying, yeah, I'm being serious. When you say to me, I am a Muslim, you do not even know anything about your religion. So when you say to me, the Muslims, you say to me, the scholars, right? Okay, the scholars. Who is the scholar who say that? Look at any scholar today. Any scholar. Okay, here we go. Give me one. Uh, go, go to, for example, um, I have watched the video of uh, Yasser Qadi. He is not like a real scholar, but who? he is who? Uh, Yasser Qadi. Dr. Yasser Qadi. Who is that? Yes, I'm probably the American. I'm a friend. Give me, give me, give me a reference. Give me a reference. Don't tell me you watch a video of this guy. You know, if I show you to you, uh -huh. watch the video of a Christian Prince, you will say a Christian Prince is not my resource, right? Okay. Show me, show me a scholar. Show me a scholar who said that. I am just saying to you, we Muslims hmm. do not accept it. That, that's it. That, that's my point. Imagine if I come to you as a Christian and say, well, mm. um, in the second century, there were Unitarians. And so this is the true Christianity. And I'm now using it against you. Do you think this is appropriate? You can use it if it's true. No problem. If it's true, you can use it against me. Why not? If this is if this is what happened, it, this is what happened. Now, when you say to me that this story is not something you accept, you need to tell me who is the one who didn't accept it and wh why he did not accept it and what is the proof that this is a false story. 
You don't just say to me, I don't accept it because there's we Muslim, we don't accept it. Be, be, simply today, anything will make Muhammad look in the, in, a, in, a, in a position of shame. You say to me, I don't accept that. Anything. No, yes, that's this is true. Here we go. When Muhammad, he says, a man, if a man is proud about his father, go and say to him, go and bite the penis of your father. I want, I want Shabir Ali to go in the TV and say the prophet, he said that. He will never say that. I want Shabir Ali says any Muslim man he can have sex uh, with a woman for three days, three uh, nights. He will not say that. I don't agree with Shabir Ali. No problem, but here we go. The Muslim today, they they fool, they fool, you know, they, they fool people with their lies. But here we go. We have a story. You see, is this a story? Is something I brought from my own? No. Is it me who 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 inserted in your books? No. So, look, I can quickly look up the. the the uh, the narration of um, what we called flirting, and I am sure that if I have, uh, if I look it up, it will say that uh, it's not accepted. Is is what? Is so what? Do, do you want me to look it to, to, to look it up for you? Look for um, what? You you asked me to bring you a scholar mm. that that says that narration is uh, in, inauthentic. Do you okay. want me to do that? Go ahead, no problem. Um. So. <clears throat> okay, this one website, uh, the one I trust, Islam Web. Okay, can you give it to me, please? Can you send it to me in uh, in uh, Skype? Okay. Oh, you saying please? Thank you very much for saying that. Hmm. Did you send it? Not yet. Uh, yeah, okay. How do I put channel? Okay, yes. <clears throat> All right, we will show it in the screen so everybody can see what you showed me. In the beginning. No problem. These narrations are okay. not, not correct. Okay. ما هي صحة الرواية etc. Okay, العربي. قال الإمام العربي قوله النبي صلى الله عليه وسلم في باطل فإنه كونه. Okay, okay. Who is the one who said that? Ibn al-Arabi, correct? Do you see it? الإمام ابن العربي. Okay. Okay. So Ibn al-Arabi is the one who is the one who made the decision that this is false. Do you agree? Is it only him? Got to no, no, hold on. Yes, yeah, yeah, only, yeah, only him, only him, only him. Read it. Here we go. Hold on. It's starting with him, starting with him. Ibn al Arabi, he said that, correct? Uh, yeah, go to, go to the end. Uh, okay. No, no, hold on, hold on. Did Ibn al Arabi, is, is Ibn al Arabi is the one who said that, yes or no? One of them. Okay. But isn't it, isn't it Ibn al Arabi is the one who said that if the Prophet, his eyes fell into a woman, her husband must divorce her? In the same page? What same page? The same in the book of Al Qurtubi. Let's focus on him. <laughs> My friend, no, yeah, fo we are focusing. Ibn al Arabi, he said to you that this story is not valid for him. But look what he said. He said that the Prophet, he have 16 privilege. He have 16 privilege. And the privilege, number 16, that if his eyes fall into a woman, it's a must for her husband to divorce her. Qala Ibn al-Arabi, haqada qala Imam al-Haramayn. Do you see it? <laughs> so Ibn al-Arabi, he says that story, is he doesn't agree with it, but he agree that if the Prophet eyes fall into a woman, he must divorce her. What do you say? Um, Christian Prince, you cannot use another example and try to discredit. Uh, uh, no, no, this is the same story. This is the same it, story it, in the same it, page. It, the same scholar you are saying to me, he don't like that story, is the same scholar who said that if the no, prophet each. his eyes, okay, when Ibn al-Arabi he said that if the prophet his eyes fall into a woman, her husband must divorce her. He meant what? Explain to me. Here we go. I'm listening. Uh, I'm, I'm not going to continue that because each, why? Why uh, not? Why not? No, my friend, you have it, to. You have it, to it, because it, because the same guy you are using for me as a proof that he don't agree with it is the same guy who's confirmed the story. Because what do you mean that if the prophet his eyes fall into a woman, her husband must divorce her? What does that mean? Christian Prince, do you not? I have said to you before that scholars are not 
infallible. They can see, the but, but this is the same scholar you're accepting now. So suddenly, the no, same scholar is a shish kebab. No, yeah, Christian, please. <laughs> not, every, 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 um, every narration, every story has to be investigated alone. My friend, uh, yeah, alone, we, alone, we, yeah, we, alone, we, we, alone. We, we, but yes, you are yes, going by a scholar. Look, look what you are doing. You are taking a scholar over, uh, over the same scholar, the same person. No, the no, same no, person. No, look, imagine, imagine here. Me, imagine how me. how much here a game we play. The same scholar, the same person. We like what he said first, and we don't hear what he like what he said second. A line after. I, I have not I have not said to you that I, I agree with this as well. I'm just showing you a website. No, you and showed they, me. No, no, no. They, because they this use, is because they they're they because their proof, their proof, their proof is false because their proof is, is funny. If, if anyway, they, if they anyway. are saying to me, my friend, if they are saying to me, this is what Ibn al Arabi said, I can show you what Ibn al Arabi said. If they are saying to me, وقال الإمام القرطبي المفسر فأما وسطر فهو زين وو 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 you do know that Muslims do not accept a story that you always argue with them against, and you, and you think this is something that's fair. That's fine. Okay, no problem. Okay, let, let, let me let me let me ask let, you a thing. Let, let, Name for me one story you agree upon, you Muslims. Just name one story for me. Anything. Choose one. Just to show you the hypocrisy of Muslims. Uh, anyways, let's let's have one last point. No, 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 no just point. wait, just wait. Name for me one story you Muslims agree upon. Which, as an example, which verse Allah He gave first to Muhammad? Do you Muslims agree upon upon that even? Even this one you don't agree upon. So what we will do now? Yeah, okay, which uh, verse? Yeah, I think, uh, Al Qalam. Al Qalam? Are you sure? Yes. Is it is it a true that there is many yeah. scholars they say it was Al Mudathir? No, this is the second one. No, this is the yeah. first one. This this goes uh, with the uh, with it with the with the the story where he where the prophet uh, as he received the revelation, recite in the name of your Lord. This is uh, very clear. I think it's it's a okay. As long it's very clear. Uh, as long yeah. as long it's very clear. Why you yeah. Muslims? You don't agree upon what is clear. That's a separate point. Let's let's move you to. See, here um, we go. Even even a simple story. Even first verse on the Quran. Which one came first? You know, some of you says Al Qalam. Some of you says Al Mudathir. Some of you says different story. So every one of you have different story. And the Muslims they agree that Allah knows best, and they do not agree about anything. The only agreement Muslims agree that we agree about not to agree what the verse mean. So when you uh, when you say to me when you say to me my, a scholar he said to... my advice to you my friend. Be be consistent. My, be consistent. My, if, my I, if I if I if I show you what your scholars they are saying and the story is reported there is not my fault. This is in your book. You, and in, in here and here actually in here in here we have a problem because if the story is not agreed upon, why it's there? Just take it off. It, obviously, it's a lie. Then why even you no, mention it? Have, no, in our books there are things that are weak. No, there let are, me tell you. Ah, there, there, there are, okay, there weak. Are, there are, there weak, are, weak, weak, okay, in, weak in is accepted, my friend. Weak hadith is accepted. Who told you that weak hadith is rejected? Um, I didn't say weak hadith are rejected. Okay, so this, this is why it's there. So now you have no, you have no confirmation that this is accepted or not. This is an opinion of a scholar. You take it because you like it, make you feel better. Because my prophet, there's no way he's a perverted. Here we go. When I showed you Al 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 Ibn al Arabi, he said that if the prophet his eyes fall, his eyes fall into a woman. Her husband must divorce her. What does that mean? What do you say about Ibn Arabi? Why? No, no. Let, 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 hold on. Why Ibn Al Arabi saying such a thing, disgusting thing? Why he's saying that? Well, I don't know. I don't know. I have never come. Okay, but no problem. But I'm asking you. I'm asking you as a, as a gentleman. I'm asking you. Why a Muslim, he is a scholar, will say such a thing about Muhammad? Give me a reason. I'm trying just to, to reason with you. I am a Muslim scholar. I love Muhammad, and he is my prophet. Why in the world I want to say that Allah, he favor Muhammad in many things. One of them, if his eyes fall into a woman, her husband must divorce her. Why I want to say that? Give me a reason. You, you want me to make an assumption? No, no, give me a reason. Don't make assumption. I want you to give me think about it. I, I, 
I, I, is I this scholar is a liar? Is he a scumbag? Is he is a he's a Christian? Is no. a Jew? Is he a Hindu? No, okay, so no, why he is saying that? Because this is make Muhammad look ugly. Why he say and if why? That's true, we'll, okay, if that's true. We we make excuses for them. Okay, so let me ask you now: Who is the scholar? He said that this this statement here is false. I don't know. I nobody. Would, uh, I don't nobody. Know. I don't know. Nobody. Nobody. Anyways, nobody. Anyways. And this is why it's here. The, the privilege okay, so, of Muhammad, the privilege of Muhammad is counted, accepted by all Muslims that this is many privilege Allah he gave him and one of them, if his eyes fall into a woman, her husband must mm -hmm. not, you know, actually, yeah, he, he's counting for you in the privilege, you will see that Muhammad, he said that he can have sex with the women but without permission of the parents, why? Why, as an example, why? In Islam, you have to get permission, correct? Okay, why Muhammad yeah. he have uh, such a privilege? Why Muhammad here number four? He says that he have the privilege of having more than four wives. Why? Why, why? he can have nikah? Yeah, why? Because he's a Muslim like the rest of the Muslims. Why he's above the Islam? When you say Muhammad, he don't have to go by Islam. It's mean he's above Islam. You see, when I say I am under yeah. the law, it's mean I have to obey the law of God. Did Musa says to his people, "You can do this, but I can." You cannot um, do that, the, but the, I can do it. And the, the 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 prophet, um, I, um, I I know that um, he he married more than four wives before Why? the uh, wait wait he married more than four wives before uh, the revelation said marry only four. So um, where where the revelation? Uh, so is, 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 no 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 is, no 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 no. Hold on hold on hold on hold on. Before the revelation, yeah. marry four. All right. But isn't yeah, it your he, prophet? He had, uh, but isn't it your prophet? Us. Okay, but isn't it your prophet? He said the one who is having more four, let her go. Let her go. He can let her go too. He told his followers, the one who is married to more than four, let the, the let the one after that go. Okay, so now let her go. Why Muhammad he keep the 13 and he is having more? And even he's making a verse saying, and when this verse here came, this is after the revelation of four about Zainab. Uh, and already Muhammad he had many wives. Uh, what about say will be only assumption? I don't want to say. You see, I don't want to talk you here. see, you are, you, are, yeah. you keep saying assumption, assumption, assumption. But as you see, everything about Muhammad is about sex. Why Allah need to give him a permission that he can have sex with the women? Even even Zainab. Where is the witnesses of Zainab? In Islam, you know that if I want to marry a woman, I have to get two witnesses. Is that correct? Mm -hmm. Okay. Did Muhammad marry Zainab without witnesses? idea man well Muhammad he married her without witnesses which means this is adultery how come if a Muslim he go and have sex with a woman he uh, is committing adultery. I, I, really, I, I really I really don't care about these things so what do you mean you don't care you have to care my, my friend you, you, have, so have, you, you are you are a gentleman you are a gentleman you know and you are trying to be fine. I'm, are, I'm, still are, okay, I'm still learning okay, still okay learning. no problem I'm, I'm asking so what, what, is it a true so is it a true the, the points that you make it's not really no it is it is because so if, because if you say if you say that I it's cannot marry I cannot marry a woman unless I have witnesses unless this is and uh, otherwise this is an adultery and then you say okay, I, will, I will look and I will look into it I will right, okay look into this no things. let me let me ask you very, my, very simple my, my, my last point I, I want to make my last point okay go ahead uh, the, my third one hmm. um, when uh, the previous uh, gentleman who talked to you yeah the one who accepted the Christ that, okay the one who accepted the Messiah I don't know for what reason hmm. he, he accepted that. the cry what uh, you can say about it go ahead I mean if someone reacts to Islam it doesn't mean that he uh, okay okay no Anyways. problem hmm. Um, he said to you that um, Judaism is is false because they are racist, and they are think they think that uh, the race is superior than mm. other races, and and they think that uh, they are more closer mm. to God because based on the race, and that's mm. racist. That's that's evidence that the religion is false. And you compare that with with the Quran when it says that um, Muslims are um, the best of nation, and you're saying that. This is also ra racism. He's but I think you that. have a. I, he is the one who said that, so I'm showing him if this is racism. Here we go. And not only yeah, that, but... I showed him where it says that you have to bring people and the chains around their necks. So Muslims are better than people to the point. It's not about like I'm better than you because I'm a believer. No, I am better than you. I have the right to enslave you and bring you with the chains around your neck. Well, my um, well, 
the point that I that I have a projection with is when you say that Muslims are Muslims think they are better than non-believers, and that that, that makes it racist. This is not no, racist. No, 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 no. You see, okay, 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 okay. The Quran is the one who confirmed that, isn't it? The Quran says, "Wa inna mushrikuna najis." Yes. Okay. What najis means? Um, translate, please. What what impure. what najis mean? Impure. Najis mean impure or mean filthy? Impure. If I take a shower and I am not a believer, that will make me clean. No, uh, the impurity of the of the non-believers is uh, spiritual, not physical. Okay. So now they yeah. are they are impure from inside them, inside out, which means they mm -hmm. are filthy. Okay. No, not only inside. Okay. Let me ask you: If I call you now, najis, is that an insult? Uh, yes. Okay. So why you have been giving yourself the right to insult me? I, I never said to you you are najis. The Quran says I, to me I, that we are najis. So are you are you saying to me you are you have a better moral than the Quran? You will not say that to me, but the Quran will say that to me. No, the Quran um, commands us to talk to the people of the book in a in a wise manner to preach to them with nice words. Is it, it, is it, it nice? Is it nice? Wait, is it nice word to say that we are the worst of the creatures? Wait, wait. Let, let me tell you. Um, so Allah commands us to talk to the people of the book in a nice way to preach to them nicely to behave nicely with them. Um, uh, and and Allah says uh, that um, do not curse. The gods of other people, so I am not um, commanded to insult you. I'm not. I'm that's, never gonna. That's funny, you. my friend. That's that's funny. Um, you, are, you are saying to me that the one who cursed the god, uh, 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 cursed the Christians, he's a bad person. Wait, wait. Is the person I who haven't... cursed the Christians? Is the person who cursed the Christian and the Jews? Is a bad person? Yes or no? Wait. Uh, I want you to understand my point. I'm in this. I'm trying. I mean, this is why I'm asking yeah. you, my friend. Can you give me the answer, yeah. please? Wait, wait, if uh, a person uh, oh, he oh. cursed the Christians. And the Jews is he a bad person? Um, Christian, uh, let me finish my point. Uh, my friend, so I am, can, you so are we finishing my. I know, we need to understand because if we jump over it, we will not get that conclusion. If you, the one, if the one, if if somebody he occurs the Christian, oh, the Jews, and is a Muslim, is he is a bad person? You asked me a question before. Let me mm. answer. Let me finish it. Mm. Yeah, you, you said to me, "Why do you insult me? Is it right to insult you?" And I'm saying, Allah did not command me to insult you. Are you sure? But I, but, Are you sure? But wait, wait. Hmm. But I have these beliefs about you. I have beliefs that you are impure. No problem. But I'm not going to go to you and say you are filthy. You are this. This is a belief that we that we hold. Hmm. The Quran, yes, but it says to you that you are impure. But it did not say it directly to you. Hmm. It's a it's a belief that we hold. It's it's okay. truth. We believe. If it. a Muslim he forced me to walk in the sewage, is that a nice of him to do so? Um, what, what is that exactly? If there is a person, if there is a person, he is a Muslim and he walk in the street, and I am coming in front of him, and then he forced me to change my way and to walk in the sewage and insult me. Is that is it's that what insult God, you? Is that what God, yes, and insult me? Is that because you forced how, me to how? walk in the sewage, to walk in the sewage, to walk to change my direction just because you are coming? You know, because you, you are coming yes. in the same way. If you force me to change my direction, is that what is is that a, the teaching of Allah to you? If I um, if I force you to change your direction mm -hmm. in the sense that I I, I I I I never move I never no no it's not about never move you force me you force me even to walk like, in the sewage like, like push you like push yes you. you have to force me to walk in the in the in in the narrow road which is the sewage is that is that so, Islamic teaching so you think force means push. My friend, why why you are afraid to say yes or no? If I am uh, walking in the way, because and you are I, coming in my other way. You are, I'm coming in here in this direction. You are coming from the other direction. I am a Christian. You are a Muslim. Is it the teaching of Islam that you have to bother me and you have to harm me to the point you make me do walk in different direction and walk in the sewage? Yes or no? Uh, Christian Prince, I just realized that we missed the point. No, no we did not miss the point. Racism, we are trying to racism, avoid the racism. answer. We are trying to avoid the answer. Racism, if racism, I am, uh, this is racism. Uh, this is racism because why? Who is who no, is the no, one no, giving you wait. the right? Who is the one who is giving you the right to push me to walk in the sewage? I am a human being like you, and you are a human being like me. Why you have the right to walk in the street? I have to walk in the sewage. Give me, give me the reason. Do you think Islam is a race? This is not the question. Why you yes, have the right to walk in this? Why you have to walk in right to walk in the street? I have the right to walk in the sewage. 
look, if, if Muslims are being, if they think they are superior than non-believers, it's not racist. This is it's a different thing. This is not about being, you think, this is not about think, this is about, you are forcing me, you are forcing me to change my direction, you are, you are insulting me, you are humiliating me. Why you need to do that? I'm saying, Christian Prince, that you... I am saying, my friend, you are running away from the answer. What kind of religion? Jesus said, bless those who curse you. Pray for those who, who, who persecute you. Muhammad, he says, if you see Christian in the street, humiliate them, insult them, Christian, never Christian respect Prince, them. You're, you're, okay, you're, now you Christian think Prince, you think you are superior. You're, you're no problem. You think you are better than me. No problem. But why you have to go to a physical harm? No, there's no physical harm. Okay, then, then read your What's prophet. It? Then your prophet hadith. Here, here we go in front of you. Read it. I wait. Um, I, I I know I know the uh, I know the, the the commentary the tafsir of this verse, and it means that when you when you walk mm. and you see a Christian coming uh, mm. in front of you, uh -huh. do not move and let them uh, take the the path. Wow. Like, it, it, Why? It means that it means that walk confidently. Be proud, um, and make them move. So, because Muslims are, you know, superior. Uh, that, that's exactly what it means. It doesn't. It doesn't mean that. Uh, so, you see, guys, we are not racist. Them. We are not racist. We believe that because I'm a Muslim, I have the right to walk you in the sewage. This is not about not to move. Don't lie. It says force him to go in the narrowest part of it. Y yes, you are a liar, yes, my awesome. friend. You see, I, I was I was very polite with you all this time. And you are no, you are you are upset. You are upset because the person before you he left Islam and, uh, and Muhammad get busted. But look 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 at this. You get yourself busted. And and uh, I walk with you all the way to the end. Where there it says don't move. Why you are a liar? It says force him to go in the narrowest part, which means is the sewage. In the old day, the sewage used to be open in the side of the road where the dirty water will go. So a Muslim he have a duty to force the Christians to walk in the sewage. And you are saying, yeah, yes, the, we are what, superior, what we are superior, what we are better than mean? you. Sewage, it's a sewage. The, it's a sewage. Force, force, what does it mean? You think it means push, and I'm saying it doesn't mean push. It, it says force him. How you can force me? How you can force me? It says force him. Force, force him may, can mean that make them how you can uh, make me i'm not give, going to walk me, in the sewage you tell me okay i'm walking in the street i'm walking in the street and you are walking in the street how you can force me to walk in the sewage explain to me use your wisdom here we go what you will put you will put for me a carrot and say hey christian prince there's a carrot there jump and get it if okay i'll, I'll give you an example if i if i was walking in a in a very narrow street hmm. um i i could you know go back and give the the person in front of me the um the uh, i could give him a chance to walk but uh -huh. i also could not give him a chance and and i walk straight him and i make him himself go back it's mm. like when you drive a car you, you, you see you, like, my friend like my friend your prophet you your prophet he got you busted look what it says force him to the narrowest part which means this is not the narrowest street force him to the narrowest part so he is the muslim he is walking in the wide part you for you walk in the narrowest part why you are lying I mean, everybody is laughing at you. Hypocrite liar. I, I call you gentleman. I call you, you are a nice person. I call you trying to see if you can get something good out of you. But you keep lying, jumping like a monkey from place to place, all over the place. You're a prophet. He is a child molester. You cannot get away with it. You're a prophet teaching you violence to disrespect, to disrespect people and to harm people. You cannot get away don't, with it. Don't, don't say it. Don't say it. I'm don't saying say that. It's in front of you. It's in front of you. If I say to you, you are not kafir, you will be insulted. If I say to you, you are najis. And by the way, you Muslims are najis because you are the one who kissed a black stone. You are the one who kissed a black stone, which is a vagina. And the hadith says, Come down, come down, come down. Come down listen, come listen, down, listen, come down, listen. Come down, this guy, guys, down, this guy, I'm, I'm coming. Uh, no, don't worry. I, this is why we talk. You are the one I'm who coming. said you go by tafsir. What if I show you that the black stone used to be the vagina where women they put their their, their, their blood vagina in it? Uh, I don't want to go into that because see, here we go. He don't want tafsir now. He want tafsir for the one suilat, wuidat. But you don't want to see for this one. So Muslims are hypocrite when they want, they choose what they like. When they refuse, the no, same, the same as the no, sperm, I'll, the I'll same as the sperm, the same as the sperm, the same as the sperm wait, wait, coming wait, from wait. the backbone. You you refuse all the Muslim scholars' explanation about the backbone and the sperm of the women coming from the ribs. Why? Because you are a hypocrite. When you want, wait. you want the when you want, you want the interpretation of the scholars only. And when you want to refuse all no, the no, scholars, I never said, I never, I never said that. I okay, then it shows for me a scholar. Choose for me a scholar. Then it shows for me a scholar speaking I, about that. Listen, listen. Get me busted. I don't want to discuss this. I don't why you don't want? Why you don't want to discuss that? Why? Because this is very embarrassing. This will exp explain no, that no, Muhammad is no, a false no, man. No, no. 
no, no, no. Then, 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 then choose for me a scholar you agree with. Chapter 86, verse number 7. Give me a scholar. He explained to us the verse in correct way. Can you? Christian Prince, do you think that Islam cannot be racist? Islam is a Islam is a racist religion because it's not uh, what Islam is, what is Islam what Islam says what Islam make it Islam make the race is about being a believer that is the yes, race in yes, Islam yes so why do you say why do you compare the racism in Judaism to Islam it's different it is not me it's who different. compare it it is you it's you Muslims who who claim yeah. that the Jews are racist why because yes, because the yes. Bible says that they are chosen people of God but the Quran confirmed that. Look, 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 I think I think the racism to think you are superior in terms of race. I think that's wrong But if you are if you think that you are superior in terms of belief, okay. I think this is justified I think this is justified. Let yes, me ask I am, you. I am better. I am better than someone who does not believe I am hmm. better than a a criminal I am better than a a a, 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 a criminal I'm better than these people. I have no problem in saying that. Okay, let me so ask you. Let, you, let, me ask you. you let me ask you did Allah created the black people to go to fire? Yes or no? You mean black people? Um, black people. I'm talking black people. Black, black people. people. Yes, black yes. people. Black people. Did Allah create them from the beginning to go to the hellfire? No. No. Okay, read this hadith for me. You mean? Okay, so let's explain. So no, no, don't explain. Don't explain. Don't... Read the hadith first and then explain. Here we go. So this is this is a Turmudi. A Turmudi. A Turmudi. Hold on. A Turmudi is one of the Sahih books. Six. The Muslim they have six hadith books writers or considered as authentic. And this is a Turmudi, one of them. Allah Messenger, peace be upon him. Allah, he said, Allah created Adam when he had to create him and he struck his right shoulder and there emitted from it white of spring. As white, the, as if they are wear, uh, white ants. He struck them, he struck his left shoulder and there emitted from it black of spring as if they wear circle. And then he said, to those who they are emitted from the right shoulder go to paradise and i don't mind and those who they are emitted from the left shoulder go to hell and i don't mind is that racist or not uh i have to read this again <coughs> where is this from the this is a turmudi uh, what's the uh, is it is it authentic or not here we not. go here we go here we go is yeah, it authentic or not is it authentic or not i mean come on well, yeah, you see, I mean, don't, don't, guys, guys, I look, at the, look at this madness. This is look at this stupid religion. This is, is this is yeah. a religion is full of what I is authentic say. and what. Why at Turmudi yes. he mentioned why the Turmudi he would say the prophet he said so if he did not say so. Is <laughs> so at Turmudi is an Imam at Turmudi a scholar or he is a scumbag? Um, yes, he's a scholar. Okay, he, so why he, a Muslim scholar? Why a Muslim scholar? You 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 accept him as a scholar? He will say such a lie if it's not true. Man, there are, there are things that I told you. There are things that are not uh, authenticated. My friend, and why are, he did not are, notice? Are, why you are a person who noticed that, but he did not notice that? How come you are smarter than a Turmuzi? Our scholars themselves tell us that there are Abdul, don't tell me our that, scholar. This guy is a scholar. He is the scholar, not you. Why this is scholar did not notice that this is cannot be true. Look, all I'm gonna say is I I will not accept the hadiths that are not authenticated. Okay, so, ho hold on, yeah. hold on. How you know it's not authenticated? I am asking you. you how you know? How you know? This, how you know? I am. How I am you know? You how that. you know? How you know it is not authenticated? That's why I'm asking you. Go down. Is there any any evidence that it it's doesn't say and say anything? It says the hadith, and this is your Muslim website. Here we go. This is alalim.com, alalim.org. Yeah, sorry, alalim.org. This is your Muslim website, not my website. Okay, Co copy, copy, copy the hadith and um, and uh, look for it in another place and see if it's. Uh, ah, it's copy the hadith and yeah. look for it in another place. What's wrong with this place? Yeah, to see if it's uh, authentic or not, uh, we have to. Okay, why is not authentic? I'm asking you if it's authentic. I'm asking I, you why it's not know. authentic. Give me a reason for I, why it's not authentic. I am. I'm not saying it's. If it's not authentic, why it's there? I am. I don't know. There are things that are not authentic. What do you mean? It's not. There's no thing is not authentic. Why is not there? I'm only gonna say to you, if it's authentic, we can. Uh, you know, I can read it for, you know, for sure. You will I say mean, to me it's not authentic. I guarantee you, you will say that because this is disgusting. No, no. 
You see, no, no, anything will make make Islam look bad. The Muslim they will say no. not authentic. This hadith was I'm there. Not, this hadith was there for 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 more than a thousand year, and you Muslims have no complaint about it. Now no, it's I'm not authentic. Not, I've never said that. I've never said that. So you, you, okay, if this hadith I'll, is I'll authentic, okay, let me ask you: if this hadith is authentic, does that mean Muhammad is a bad person? Muhammad can never be a bad person. I see, it doesn't I, matter. I will, Even if yes. Muhammad, you say so. See, guys, see yeah. the hypocrisy. No, no, no. Okay, so now why you are saying this is not authentic right away and making a conclusion? Have, okay, how many times? So I am, I am saying to you. Okay, now I'm asking yeah, you. Allah, if Allah, Muhammad, Allah. if Muhammad, he said that, is that will make Muhammad bad? You said no. So which means even if Muhammad he is racist and he hate the black people, still you will not have a problem with that. Okay. If uh, if that if that um, hadith is authentic, mm. then because the prophet is always perfect, he can never say uh, things that are wrong. Who is the donkey? Who is the donkey? Let me finish. Let me finish. No, 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 no. Who is the donkey? He said to you that Muhammad is always perfect. Does that mean you, you, you Muslim believe that Muhammad is God? No, I'm saying perfect. You are saying to me he is perfect. Everybody sense. heard you. You said he is perfect. He's always perfect. Guys, did he say he's always perfect? Perfect human, no, perfect human character. Uh, yeah. Perfect yeah. human character. That's mean he's perfect. Yes. When you say perfect, what do you, what do you mean by perfect? Perfect in the sense that the best human being, that um, the, the the best possible. Okay, human, let me ask you: Do the best uh, human yeah. being? Do the best human being do things against God? Against God. Against Dis God. Disobey. Teaching. Yes. Dis against God. God? Like he fabricate mm. laws, he fabricate laws, like he forbidden things or he allowed things which is not allowed by God. Do he do that? No, no, he no. Has, he so, guys, that. remember what he said. He said the best man, Muhammad. He there is no way he will fabricate law which is not approved by God. Here we go. This is the Quran, the chapter of at tahrim Allah, he said to him, "Lima tu harim? Why you are forbidden what Allah made law for for you? Why Muhammad is forbidden what is made law for for him?" Making false law because you remember you are Muslims, you follow what Muhammad he do, you call it Sunnah. And if Muhammad, if Muhammad forbid something, hold on, hold on. If Muhammad forbid something, you Muslims, you forbid it too. Is that correct? Uh, yes. Okay. So now Muhammad he forbid yeah. something, and it's not lawful for him to forbid. Okay, do, do you know what this and you are the one who said to me, Yeah, I know what does that mean. And you are the one who said to me five minutes ago that there is no way Muhammad he will fabricate law against God teaching. No, no, it's not, it's not really a a big issue, like in terms of uh, what do you mean, big issue? You must follow him, you must follow him blindly, whatever he's saying. You accept if he forbid it no. to himself, you forbid it to yourself. If no, you know, he, 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 look, look, he never said, uh, Look, this this uh, this verse has a uh, the uh, 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 what? Uh, come on, the uh, 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 yeah, what? Okay, no, wait. Um, uh, let me say this. It was a uh, about uh, uh, an uh, event uh, that happened. Uh, he he. Um, hey. Wait. Uh, I'm, trying, I'm trying to remember. Yeah, 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 yeah. Remember, yeah, he, he, uh, yeah. Fabricate a lie. Yeah. Uh, he, he. Uh, come on. He fabricate lie. He fabricate a lie. He he he. he, he, he. Uh, let me remember. Uh, he, he. Man, let me say this. Let me let me speak. Uh -huh. um, it uh -huh. was about a honey. Uh, it's about uh, honey. It's about honey. What? How Muhammad he forb how Muhammad forbid the honey if the Quran speak of the honey? He never he never forbid honey. Wait. You are the one who he, just he, said to me. You are the one he, who he said just not, said to me he, he forbid honey. He, he did not. He did. He forbid himself from eating honey because uh, his wives were. Uh, okay. Were, what if I get you busted that this that. is about Muhammad cheating with his with his slave? Well, I'll show you evidence that it's about uh, honey. Okay. I, I I know this is conflicting. Yeah. Hold on. A second ago, you said this is not about honey. So now, no, confirm to me. Is it about honey or not? Is it about honey or not? This was about honey. Okay. Yes. But a second ago, isn't you who said to me this is not about honey? No, I said this was about honey. He All right. Did not eat okay. Honey. Hold on, guys. Hold on. So this is not this is not about honey. This is about honey. So, this is not so, about honey. This is about why, honey. So why so now so, so why, now why, you are saying why, why, to me it is about honey. Do you confirm that this is about honey? Yes, this was about honey. He didn't All right, here we go. Honey, because his wife. Okay, 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 like okay, 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 okay. So okay. he did not really create okay. laws. Here we go. Anyways, you got, Muhammad, you go Muhammad, he forbid himself. Topic. Hold on. Muhammad, here we go. This is the tafsir. This is the tafsir. It says that this is about Mary the Copt. What we will do now? 
Uh, I will. Uh, I know that uh, the honey exists. The this honey is not about exists. the no problem. But the, the, I, the tafsir says that this is about Mary the cook. What we will do? The, the, the one I trust is, is about the honey. I think we will go with the honey no story. Let's, let us go with your version. Okay, Muhammad he forbid himself from eating honey. How you said to me a, a second ago that the Prophet he will never forbid something is not approved by Allah and Muhammad he forbid himself from drinking honey. Why? When we say when we say that um, Muhammad can never uh, fabricate laws, we, we say in the sense that uh, he may tell us that this is unlawful mm. and it's maybe a lie, but this is not the same as him not eating because when Allah says mm. do not forbid because when Allah says, um, why do you forbid yourself? It's not the same as why do you create laws? Because Allah does not like us to do, um, to, um, mm -hmm. uh, Allah does not like us to, uh, mm -hmm. for example, uh -huh. to make things that are lawful. Uh -huh. um, look, I, I think there's a difference in terms of law and in okay. terms of, um, okay. I, I think this one is a, okay. A this is Tafsir Ibn Abbas. Issue. You, you mentioned to me issue. before, you mentioned to me before Ibn Abbas, correct? Ibn Abbas look like you like him. This is Ibn Abbas. What Ibn Abbas he said about this story? Read for me. Christian uh, Prince, you're not going to convince me of this. I'm, I'm not convincing you. I'm getting you busted. This is Ibn Abbas. Is Ibn Abbas work for Christian Prince? Okay, let me let me find you that story. Let me find you. Don't find me the story. It's in front of you. Here we go. He says no, this is about I'll, I'll your prophet was myself. sleeping with Mary the Copt. I'll find, I'll find it myself. My friend, I know what you will find. No problem. Here we go, Ibn Abbas in the front of us. We can find, we, we get you, we get you about the honey. Don't worry about it. Ibn Abbas, is he lying here? Man, what do you always say? Is he lying or is he, is he not a scholar? Why is he, he saying he, that? Uh, is it Ibn Abbas? Is, is it Ibn Abbas, the one who Muhammad only named him as a scholar for Islam? Hmm? Muhammad, his, he uh, named... He yeah. prayed, he prayed, he asked Allah for Ibn Abbas to be the Hebrew Umma, the, 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 the ink of, okay. of, of scholarship. Okay, so Muhammad, okay. he okay. is the one who promotes uh, Ibn Abbas to be the scholar of the nation. And as you know, if Muhammad prayed to Ibn Abbas, obviously Allah will, uh, will accept his prayer, correct? Uh, if, yeah. Allah, if Allah Prophet, he prayed to Allah that to make Ibn Abbas the scholar of Islam, are you saying to mm -hmm. me that Allah he did not answer Muhammad's prayer? No. Okay, so here we go. But, uh, Ibn, but Abbas, it's, it's, Ibn Abbas is the giving us the interpretation. The Are you saying to me that the prayer of Muhammad came in the wrong person, the wrong location? He chose the wrong one? But here we go. Because this is by the guidance of Allah, Ibn Abbas became a scholar of the nation. And look what he's saying. This is about Mary the Copt. Okay, no problem. No problem. Okay. But so why uh, I, 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 I go with the one that about the the, the the honey story okay no problem let us go with the honey then why Muhammad forbid the honey hmm? why Muhammad forbid the honey he did not forbid it he in forbid the it. Sense that it he, says he to harim. why you forbid right. yourself why it's, you forbid it's yourself it, 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 I'm saying it's different it's not like saying he he um, he invented something that God said he's not saying Allah said Allah made it unlawful when it is lawful he did not do that he only um, he only not ate it and he made it kind of like made it unlawful but not literally he made it unlawful. my friend like the arabic did, word not, says it clearly the arabic word says it clearly lima to harim why you make unlawful stop lying lima to harim okay okay so okay. what okay. he did arabic, harima in, in harima, arabic. You harimu. okay okay let me let me say this hmm. in arabic we say why do you forbid yourself from eating it does not mean it does not mean that you are literally saying god has made it unlawful it can it, it means that why do you why do you not eat it and and uh, so you are saying you... to me you are saying to me you have a city god he is in heaven he created the galaxies and seven galaxies as, as muhammad he said seven seven heaven and then he is worried about muhammad he is not eating honey so Allah, he sent a verse to Muhammad saying, Hey, Muhammad, why you don't eat honey, honey? Huh? No, no, honey, no, Muhammad, no, no, no. this is what you are saying to me. Muhammad don't want to eat honey. What is the problem of Allah? If a person, he don't like to eat honey. As an example, I don't like to eat uh, something. I don't like no, ice okay. cream. Well, Allah will send me a verse from heaven says, why you don't like to eat ice cream? No, no, Allah Allah disagreed. To, uh, Allah did not like the, the uh, when when Muhammad um, forbid himself, he 
he, he, he obeyed his wife. Okay, what is the problem with Allah? What is the problem of Allah? Why he is this is very important. Muhammad, he don't want to eat honey. Why it is a big okay. issue for Allah? It, it's because because he obeyed uh, his wives and and, and he, he and why he his wives point. don't want Muhammad to eat honey? What's the problem? That's it. Oh, now we're changing the topic. No, we are not you're, because you are saying to me his wife. No, we are not. We are not. This is funny. You're, you're, why the wives no, no, of you're, Muhammad? You're, you're, why you're the wives was, of Muhammad? This is how funny was. you are. Why the wives of no, Muhammad? No, no. Listen, listen, you are so why, upset. Why I understand you're very upset because people leave in Islam after talking to me. No problem. But now more people will leave Islam listening to you. Why the wives of Muhammad, they force Muhammad to do not to eat honey. So you, you want to change the topic? It's I'm not, not changing about, the topic. Uh, you see, you, he, you are scared. Himself. You see, when you are in the corner, you say you are changing the topic. We are speaking about the same topic. You just said no, 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 that the no, prophet no, of you are the one who said that, that the prophet of the prophet wives they force Muhammad not to eat honey just yeah, to make them they, guys. Did he say? Did he say that Allah? He said to Muhammad, "Why you obey your wives?" Did he say the word obey? Okay, Muhammad obey his wives, which means they gave him an order not to eat honey according to you. What kind of a prophet he obey his wives regarding such a silly thing? What do you mean by obey? And what do you mean he will not eat honey? And why the wives they are forcing Muhammad not to eat honey? Are they anti honey group? So your uh, objection is no longer about him um, forbidding what Allah has made lawful. Well, he will go. He forbid. You are the one who said that Allah, because Allah is no, making an issue of it. No, no, you see, you see. No, I see you, are, you are trying no, to run away. Your, you are the one who no, said. No, no, you are the no, one no, who no, said. No, no, everybody no. heard you. I see, that I see Muhammad you running obey, away. From obey. Your everybody objection. is laughing at you. More Muslims will leave no, Islam. No, no. You will yeah, see. Yeah, yeah, okay. Listen, Muhammad. He yeah, obey his uh, wife. I'm no one. I'm no one. You are no one. No. Ah, now you are no one because now you you make people obey your prophet. Listen, how Muhammad? How Muhammad? He obey his wife. Explain to us. Go ahead. So, do you agree that? Um, do do you, do you uh, agree that you said that Muhammad he obeyed his wife? Your objection before was about. Did you say that? Did you say? Do you just say that Muhammad obeyed his wife, or I'm lying? Did he? Did you say Muhammad he obeyed his wife? Was your problem about forbidding what Allah has made? Yes, I, my problem is about what yes. forbidding. Okay, so, so, so why he so forbid it? Hold on, hold on. So you are it? saying to me, yeah. you have a prophet of God who is not forbidden from eating honey, but he is willing to disobey his God and he obey his wives in order to make his wives happy over God. That's what you just said to me. So now we have a person whose name is Muhammad is obedient to his wives, but he is not obedient to Allah. No, no, no. What do you mean? No, no, no. It's you who said that. It's... Muhammad, when he forbid the honey, he was obedient to Allah or obedient to his wife. You are the one who used the word obey. You are the one who Look, said, he, he, Allah, he said to him, why you obey your wives? You are the one who said that. Look, the word forbid, as I said to you in the beginning, it's different. You know, in Arabic, when we this say... This is not the question. Why it's, Muhammad it's, it's obeying different. his wives over obeying Allah? He is a prophet of God. He's always guided and he is always protected by Allah. So it, how Muhammad, not, he makes such a stupid aided. thing. Obeying his wives, not, he did not disobey Allah. Okay. It's quite different. No, no, it's he did. Different. He did. He did. He, he's, he's, he's not saying this is unlawful for me. And uh, Allah Abdul, Abdul, Abdul let me not... get you busted. Let me get you busted. Did, did Allah? He says to him, "I forgive you," in the verse. In this verse. In this verse, it's that, that Allah He says to him, "Wallahu ghafurun rahim," and I forgive you. And Allah is all merciful over you. Did He forgive him? So He forgave him. This is a sin. Allah, uh, uh, Allah has for um, uh, this uh, verse especially. Uh, yeah. Uh -huh. Allah says uh, He's uh, uh, forgiven and merciful. Yeah. Forgiven for what? For the sin He did. Which one? Which He forbid Himself from having sex with Mary the Copt. According to you, it is honey. Okay. So uh, regardless, it is honey or it is Mary the Copt, and obviously it's Mary the Copt. He, Allah, He say, I forgive you for doing that. So it was a sin, and Muhammad. Is forbidding himself, and obviously Muhammad, he is the one who fabricated this verse. He forbid himself from having sex with Mary. She was, she is not his wife, and it's a big fat lie. The Muslim they say he married her, and I can show the proofs right now. He never married her. He was sleeping with her, and she is not lawful for him because there's nowhere in the Quran it says you can have sex with a slave girl unless she is captive. Is that correct? Hello. Are you there? Don't die on me.
हेलो यू आर देर आई हेयर यूर ब्रीदिंग I'm not going to hang up on you. Uh well, yeah, what did you say? Uh I'm saying you... when your prophet when your prophet was you, did your prophet have sex with Mary the Copt? Yes or no? He he married her. Where it says that he married her? Can you show me? Well, we we know that. Uh, okay, well, no no, don't it, tell me we know that. Where where it's where is the proof that he married her? Okay, let's have a look. Hmm. Marriage of Mary, the hmm. marriage of Rasul, men, Mary al hmm. Let's have a look. Hmm. Let's have a look. قصة ماريا القبطية وسبب إسلامها. The story of Maria the Copt and her conversion to Islam. Story. Conversion too. She converted too. Okay. Hmm. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's right, Islam. Hmm. Um. It's in the in the seal, the seal. Okay. It's in the seal. Okay, okay, in the seal. Where? Give me, give me the reference, my friend. Give me the reference in the seal. Go ahead. What? What in the seal? What it says in the seal? Um, there's a website. Uh, Okay. You join to the, the, what, the link. What website? is the website? Okay. What is? No, read for me what the seal says. Give me the reference. Um, it's just mentioned that it's in the seal and the, uh, the well, history. Friend, don't tell me it's mentioned in the seal because this is a big fat lie. Muhammad he never married from Mary the Copt. Well, we Muslims believe that. I don't care whether you agree or not. <laughs> yeah. Okay. We Muslims believe in that. You agree or not? Who care? But this is a big fat lie. No Muslim agree with that. Can you show me the proof? Well, uh, every Muslim I know here, he knows that this story. So well, every well, Muslim knows. Every Muslim knows. Who is the every Muslim knows? Can you show me the reference? <laughs> it's in the in the seal. Yeah. What in the seal? Where? Where? I mean, uh, I cannot just give you a specific uh, one in, in two seconds, but uh, I know this in the seal. Uh, so, uh, what? The, uh, Wait. Uh, uh, anyways, what's your point? We believe it to be. My point is, my point is that hmm. your prophet here he made something forbidden, which is not to sleep with Mary the Copt, and Allah He said to him, "Why you are making unlawful what is made lawful for you? Can you show me where it says that Mary the Copt was lawful for him?" And you agreed that Muhammad he slept with Mary. Uh, yeah. In this particular verse, as I told you, it was about the honey. No I, problem, uh, no problem. But your prophet he slept with Mary the Copt, correct? And you agreed. Okay. When Muhammad he, he, he slept with Mary the Copt, is that Islamic or this is against Islam? I don't know specifically, but um, why you do not know specifically? Some, why you do not know? Why Mary? you do not know? Is hmm? it against Islam or it is lawful in Islam to have sex with a slave women who you did not capture? Did not capture? Yes, uh, Mary, Mary the Copt is not a slave he captured from in war. It was a gift. Santa Claus so come slave. to him. Santa Claus, he knocked so at the door. Prisoner of war. Hmm? Yeah. Look at the door. Muhammad opened the door. He found Mary and a bunch of slaves coming from Egypt as a gift. Is that correct? Uh, I don't know about the, the gift, but... Uh, Okay, anyway, I'm asking uh, you according to Islam, the, according uh, to Islam, according to Islam, are you allowed? Yeah. Are you allowed to sleep with the woman? She is a slave, but not captive. Isn't a slave the same as captive? No, captive well, slave is different. The Quran, pri the, prisoners of war, okay, my friend, my friend. Okay, can you show me the reference? Can you show me the reference in the Quran where it says you can have sex with a slave girl? She is not a captive. Men, slave girls, prisoners of was it the same, isn't it? No. Isn't that what you're talking about? No. The Quran, well, you see, you are a person, you see, you, you play all kinds of games. 
Here we go. You are free to choose for me any Islamic interpretation of your wish. No, I, the Quran, I don't know your, uh, the Quran, the Quran allow you to have sex with the slave girl you captive. Yes, okay, yeah. Okay, okay. Mary the Copt was not a captive. Oh, Muhammad was no. sleeping with her. I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? I don't know. Suddenly you do not know. I don't know, know if that really happens. I might, I might need to look at, look into that. Mm -hmm. Well, Muhammad yeah. obviously he was obeying, disobeying the Quran because the Quran says, وَمَا مَلَكَتْ أَيْمَانَكُمْ Go and do the okay. F. Go and do the F. Chapter four, verse number thirty-three. Okay, have have sex, no problem. Okay, go and have sex, sex with it four okay. and two, two and three and four, and whatever you own in your right hand possess. Malakat aymarkum, malakatul yamin is only yes. the slave captive. Okay, prisoners of a woman. Okay. Yes. Okay. So where in the Quran allow you to have sex with Mary the Copt? I do not get your. Uh, Mary the Copt is not one of the slave captives. She is just a slave. She was a gift. So the Quran allow you to have sex with the slave captive of war. Nowhere it so mentioned he, that you can have sex with the slave. She is not captive I, I, of war. I, I told you uh, the prophet married her. That's what we believe. That's a big fat lie. You want me to get you busted in two seconds? I, I, I don't care. That's what we believe. Uh, this is clear. Here the, we go. Here we go. Yeah, this is we, Islam a question. This is your scholar. The same website you gave me. The same website. Islam. That uh, awful. The same website. Here we go. It says that Mary the Copt is not the wife of the prophet. She was not. She was not. Okay. She was not. And then she was. Okay. Yeah. Here we go. There is no doubt. That Mary the Copt was a companion of the Prophet. Okay, he's asking if she was she a wife of the Prophet. The, the answer, no, she is not. Okay. So now the question: When Muhammad was sleeping with Mary the Copt, and he got busted by his wives, and they made him swear that he will never do it again. And then Allah he says to him, Why you forbid what is made lawful for you? But nowhere in the Quran it says it's made lawful for a man. To uh, have they sex. told you, Christian Prince. Uh, no, I, I take the, the honey story. No problem. Take, forget uh, about the honey now. Forget about this verse. Yeah, how Muhammad, you, 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 how you Muhammad to, okay, uh, hold on. How Muhammad was having sex with the women if nowhere in the Quran it says it's lawful for you to have sex with a slave girl unless she is a captive? So we are saying he is committing adultery according to Islam. He's committing a clear adultery. Allah in the Quran, He give you permission to have sex with a slave to rape only slave girls who they are captive of war. No, no rape, no rape. Just well, what do you mean then no rape? She's a slave. You are you are sleeping with her against her will. No, don't lie. No, not against her will. Okay, no you're, problem. You're no problem. We can show you what that. happened to Safiya. We can show you what happened to Safiya. Muhammad, that. Muhammad, he forced Safiya to have sex in the same day he killed her family. Was she willing to open her legs for him after he killed her father and her husband and her brother in the same day? The same, the same day. I'm the not same sure, day. Yes. I, I, I know. I know. Soon after that, she did. No, no. The same day. The same day. I can show you. I can give the reference. Don't, don't play games. Okay. You, you no, know. I, I know. I. Okay. I, I know it was. I know it was soon after. Okay. That. Same she, day. She, same day. Did not even pass the town. In the same day, do you think a woman, her husband, he was killed, and her father was killed, and her brother was killed just a two hours ago? And now she will take off her panty willingly to a man who killed her family. Do you believe in that? Well, well uh, we, we know she, uh, she herself. So Why not? She, she, her, she herself. Yeah. She herself said that uh, she's she horny. willing. Yeah, she's willing. No, she no. said that. Absolutely. Isn't it, yes. is it a guy who was God? He was guarding your prophet because he was, was afraid that she might kill the prophet when she's sleeping with him. And, and the prophet he said to him why you are here he said i'm afraid that you will kill you because you just killed her father and you killed her brother and you killed her husband you just killed them mm -hmm. now answer me right. why you're a prophet sleep with mary the copt if nowhere in the quran allowing him to sleep with her um, she's uh, either her uh, his wife she is not his or, wife here we go this is you scholar or, saying she never or, she never or, married him or she, she she was a prisoner of war. She is not a prisoner of war. She was a gift from the ruler of Egypt. 
she was um, she said, I, I don't know I don't know uh, I don't know I don't know that. my friend yeah. I'm, I'm very thankful that you call me I'm sure many Muslims they will leave Islam because you did a very good job and you I'm no one. I, I just yeah. want to tell them that I'm no one I'm just uh, ah suddenly you are no speaking, one yeah. okay you are no yeah, one right one. okay yeah, no yeah, but no problem I, I mr. no you, one my, my guys mr. Trend. no one mr. no one he was a great help yeah. exposing his prophet his a prophet yeah. he, he is the yeah. one who said the prophet he obey his wives over obeying Allah no, he, is, he is the one who I said not, that he's a prophet. That. Yes, you, you know, actually, actually, you discovered for us a very important you, you thing. Are, you are the one who hold uses on, hold on, hold on, guys, the, guys. Arguments when, when you, use. when he say that you the prophet the who who obey, website, when he said, Quran, when he said, hold on, when he, heretics. when he said the prophet he obey his wives. You know what he did? He showed us that Muhammad he have a he have a problem. He's not a man enough because he's obeying no, his no. wives in the wrong. Oh, you're a sexist. Do you do not believe in in women rights? No, and, and, ah, and women, women rights. Look who's talking. And, and ah, so you are oh. saying to me, okay, hold so on. You, you think it's a shame? Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yes, rights. it's a shame. Look, wow. It's a shame in Islam wow. because the man, wow. because the man, the man. Wow. Shut up, shut up, shut up, shut up, Abdul. <laughs> Let me get you busted. Is it the Quran in chapter four, verse thirty-four says, <laughs> "If your wife disobey you, you beat her"? Is the Quran says so, that if your wife disobey you, you beat her? Yes or no? Why why do you think it's bad to answer a, a answer line? answer does well, the why, Quran why do does the Quran does the Quran because now he's not a Muslim according to Islam why? he's not, he's not a Muslim because Islam says uh, you you have to force tell your me, wife to, to obey you you have to force your wife to obey why? you and if you don't why? you beat her so how Muhammad now is obeying his wives as you say it which is against Islam why did you say he is not man enough to obey his wife because why according to Islam he's according to Islam he is not man enough the, because a no, man no, 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 a no, man no. and a man in Islam he should pay he should he should beat his wife if she disobey him am I lying no you no when you said that here he we was go not man enough yes Wait, let me say let me let me finish shut up let, shut up your donkey shut up your donkey son of muta even in Christianity women she have to obey her husband so yes, I am. I stay with my opinion. 